Hi, it's me again, Rike, um, and welcome to yet another YouTube Activer video review. I mean, it's clear it's a video, but still, you know, welcome. <laughs> so, um, today I want to talk about a brand that is maybe a bit more um, accessible for us Europeans. Uh, the brand is called Eamon. Um, it's a Swedish brand, so uh, for me, I'm just basically sitting at the source, <laughs> so that's uh, really nice. Um, but they also do deliver like worldwide, of course, so even if you're not European, you can definitely order. And they also just do have an, um, a hub for New Zealand and Australia, and their own website for that, so you know, that like I think it's great for all of us, basically. <laughs> but for us Europeans, it's definitely great because we can save on those uh, import fees. <laughs> Um, and at least for me in Sweden they do have uh, free shipping uh, over a certain amount of money and like I said no extra costs or anything and also I'm very lucky to have an actual store <laughs> here because um, they do have two stores in Sweden uh, so for me it's really really nice and handy whenever they have a new release I can just go there and just try out the stuff myself and I don't have to order online you know then figure out what I want to keep and then send it back because yes this time it is also easy for us Europeans to return stuff so I've definitely also ordered from them before uh, online if there was something not available in the store or you know um, just yeah basically if not something wasn't available in the store and I knew I wanted this uh, and it is easy to return I think if you do return something you do pay at least uh, for Sweden you do pay like 30 kroner, so like 3 euros, 3 dollars, around 3 dollars. Um, like a return fee, basically, so the shipping value, but you do have a pre-printed um, shipping label and everything, return label, so it's like super simple. Um, and yeah, I mean, it's, it's not that bad, you know, <laughs> compared to um, the cost that we would have to, um, you know, pay like for, for doing something like this if we wanted to return something to somewhere else uh, outside of Europe so I think it is super um, nice and super handy and uh, yeah so basically um, this brand is so it was founded by two uh, women and um, I mean they're Swedish so <laughs> um, I guess if you know what Swedish styles like it's a, it's a, you know minimalist and a bit more like like see I don't, I don't I'm not a style expert so I'm just describing what I think it is uh, and you know like a lot of like neutral colors and black and white and this is also basically what they do but sometimes they do have a pop of color um they do have some patterns so but it's like a lot of their stuff that they constantly have is like very basic so i think like one of their most famous or like most popular collections is always like they have this seamless um stuff and their seamless stuff is super popular and they do have some of like like beige colors like coffee colors that they keep restocking because people love them so much and it's really like like beige tones like some coffee some um lighter brown tones that are really really popular that they always keep bringing back and um yeah people love those and see i'm more of a color person um especially now that i'm here in sweden i'm just like i don't wear black leggings to the gym that's boring because you know 99% of people wear black leggings to the gym, so I might wear a black top because if I wear a lot of colors, basically I, you know, I, I started realizing what I need is more black and white tops, so I could at least wear something with all the colors I wear. But I, um, I, I really love colors, and I think it's like they just make me happy, you know. Uh, but of course, sometimes it's nice to have some basic pieces, and like I said, they also do have colors, so I do have a lot of colors from them as well. Um, so yeah, like I said, their seamless is kind of the signature. Um, and uh, we can just get into that. I will show you one it's like seamless set I have. Um, and it doesn't have to, like, I don't know if they have this particular color still, but they have so many colors on their website. Like I said, they have so many basic colors on web their website. So let's just uh, dive into that, shall we? So, um, <laughs> just to show you the, the color scheme, this is like, for example, some, a navy long sleeve top they have. This is some more like lighter blue, like jeans washed, you know. Then bright yellow, no problem, you know. Bright pink, also, they had that. Bright orange, sure. <laughs> um, this is more of a peachy color. They also had that, you know. And so what I wanted to show you, as I said, <laughs> is this nice like teal color they had. So basically, 
what I call the set is like usually what I like to um, get from them is like this long sleeve, tight, um, seamless top, and you can see like it's you have this ripped material and it's super stretchy, super nice. Um, so in these long sleeve tops, they're always the same. So basically, it doesn't matter which color you get it in. If you get one of these seamless tops, they're always the same, and um, they do. Uh, like for me, in my arms, they run a little tight, so I like to size up and these long sleeve tops to a medium. And I usually always do that. So recently, they had this nice, like, bright orange color on sale, and they only had it on sale. <laughs> like, so it was super on sale. And the only size left was, like, extra small, and I was like, sure, I'll do that. Also fits. Honestly, also fits. It's not bad at all, like, but it's just the medium gives me a little more room to move, you know, especially like with the, the arms, you know, and the shoulders and everything. So yeah, I prefer a medium in these. And um, it's super stretchy, super nice and ripped, and yeah, to go with that. Same material. Um, let's see, what is this material anyway? <laughs> uh, it's 92% polyamide and 8% elastane. So, just so you know. Um, they have this really simple... Uh, ripped bra, like the ripped seamless bra, and like I said, it's just so simple. It's like up and down design. They're so comfortable. I like to wear them under like everything, basically. I also have a ton of these bras because they are so comfortable. Um, yeah, stretchy again. There's not really much to it. They have super thin cup heads in there, so I don't think they like really uh, like gnaw or anything. It's just like you know, ripped waist uh, rip waistband, a ripped band here underneath as well, and it's just so simple, so so good. And to go with that, we have um, this ripped seamless legging. Also, their logo is also always super nice. You have this metal uh, metal plate here. And um, yeah, so this is the full length. They always, or not always, but usually they have like 7 8 in full length. The full length on me is a bit, you know, 7 8 as well. So I usually don't, the 7 8 are too copper for me, <laughs> on me. Um, and what is really nice about their leggings, they have this nice... Uh, low dipping uh, glute seam here so to really accentuate that butt um, yeah and just stretchy uh, I don't find them to be super squat proof <laughs> to be honest um, but yeah I'll show you in a bit um, like the darker colors are okay like if you wear like neutral underwear I think but <laughs> so um, when I had for example this this bright yellow um, yeah definitely not squat proof and the fun thing was though it came with a seamless nude thong. So I guess it was them, you know, their way of saying, yes, we know these are not scrub proof, but they're still beautiful. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, for me also, like this kind of material, I do tend to see the sweat a little more because it's more like, I, I, I know it's not cotton, but it's more cotton. It's not like as sweat wicking as some other materials. So I don't wear these for like really high intense workouts. I've definitely worn these for like some more weightlifting stuff, for yoga pilates, that kind of stuff. And I think that's really, for that it's great. Um, and I mean it also really depends on how much you sweat and how much you care about if you can see sweat or not. But if I just know I don't like to wear them for super high intense workouts. Um, where I do sweat a lot, so yeah, there's that. But um, yeah, let's see this on, shall we? Alright, here we have the seam ripped seamless from Amon. So this is the bra. And these are the leggings, and like I said, they're just super comfortable. Like I do have this, in, or at least the bra, in so many colors. You just wear this underneath, underneath everything. Um, and the leggings are nice and high waisted, no front seam here. And then, like I said, the glute seam is very nice and flattering um, for the glutes here. With this deep, um, with the V here, and uh, yeah, the bra scoops nice and low as well. So you have more of an open back here. And yeah, it's very stretchy and very comfortable, you know, I can just do everything. Um, and then, like I said, we have this uh, long sleeve top to go with it as well. Uh, I'll just quickly throw this over. And like you see, oof, just need to kind of wiggle your way into it a little bit. But once you get there, it's really, really nice and comfortable, it keeps you, you know, dressed and warm and yeah goes with it nicely. The bra disappears underneath it, so you don't have to necessarily wear the same, uh, you know, the bra that goes with it as well. Um, yeah, they don't, it doesn't really move with you when you move your arms, so that's really good as well. And yeah, just gets you, keeps you covered, keeps you a little warm if you need that. And um, 
Yeah, let's see the squat test for this, shall we? Because I, like I said, I sometimes do have a little problem with that. All right, uh, next up, I just want to show another design they had with their seamless, um, or next, I don't know if they, they're not really seamless, you know, there's definitely seams. Um, leggings that they had, they're like, um, they have the, these holes here in the, at the calf area, and then he, up here, which is a bit, you know, like, I mean, I don't know if you can see it, but, ah, how, how do I show this best? Um, up here, exactly. Um, this is a bit more risky for me with like pulling up in my thighs also not the skinniest you know and I'm so if I do size up to a medium it's the waist is just gaping terribly so I don't do that I'd rather have the nice tight waist and then you know have it a little tighter in the thighs and with the other uh, ripped seamless leggings I never have a problem with tightness in the thighs or anything but with these I can definitely um, I definitely have that a little more but it's okay and um, yeah, it's just a bit, you know, with the holes on the thighs here, it's maybe not the, the greatest uh, thing to have. But again, also here we have these nice, this nice dip here in the glute seams to accentuate your butt a little more. And these also did come in more colors than just this uh, bubblegum pink. <laughs> and yeah, no, I did not make this up. This color is called bubblegum pink. Um, yes. Let's see it on. Alright, this is me in complete bubblegum. So like I said, these are a bit of a different legging. This front seam is not a proper front seam, so this is actually just a fake seam in the front here. And, and then you have these details here on the thighs. So you have the holes here, some um, rib detail, and then you have some uh, holes here at the bottom. So you have to be super careful when you put these leggings on so you don't rip anything. Especially if you, if you have longer nails, which I don't have, but still, like, you know, even I have to be careful. Like, if I pull up here on the thighs to get it higher on, on me, or like, you know, you have to be very careful. These are also like 7 8 length for me. Let's just see this again here. So, um, yeah, I have to be a little more careful um, when uh, putting these on. And um, uh, I can... Yeah, I can, so these feel a little tighter on my thighs compared to the ripped seamless material. Which is also why I don't like to wear these as often because the other ones are just more comfortable, you know? And like I still have a, you know, a little gaping kind of a feel at the, at the waist with these, even though, um, yeah, I shouldn't. I, I, I can't size down more than this because of the thigh. Uh, situation with thigh tightness here, but yeah, I mean these are a very fun color, you know. Also, again, like if you look at the back, you have this nice um, V shape here to kind of accentuate the butt a little. And yeah, so these are um, they have. I mean they have different, more even different seamless design, but this is one of the other ones. Alright, next up, I want to talk a little bit about their loungewear, because I think their loungewear is also really, really nice. Um, and they do also have a focus on that a little bit with some pieces, or like, basically with every collection, they do have some loungewear coming out. And I'm actually currently wearing um, some joggers from them, with like a nice drawstring, like a paperback waist, super, super loose here. Um, but I can talk about them a little more in the try-on. And um, yeah, these are just so comfortable, I actually got them twice now because I wear them so much and like it feels like you're wearing pajama pants but a bit more classy so <laughs> uh, I really like that for um, you know working from home but also I can wear these to the lab and uh, <laughs> just throw on some you know sneakers and, and a jumper or something and it will still look like I'm actually wearing stuff so <laughs> that is that is always nice um, but yeah let's see them on all right, next I want to talk about these very comfy joggers. So they have this nice drawstring and like a kind of paper bag waist. And like, so this is a small, right? But like, I have so much space at the waist still. And they're also so nice and wide in the, you know, in the legs. I mean, it's kind of still like a bit of a more like tighter fit, but like still there's so much, like there's so much stretch to them and they feel so soft. And um, these are also like a, yeah, seven, eight length on me, which is fine. And um, they have some nice deep pockets here as well. The nice logo here on the side. And yeah, it just, you know, fits well. Fits nice and loose, comfy. Um, can just throw like a cropped ho hoodie over it or something. 
a jumper and you just like that's your outfit <laughs> for working from home for just going outside you know so yeah that's really nice and uh, comfy probably like it doesn't give you the best shape or anything but it's still like it's just you know comfortable so yeah all right next up I want to talk about their new collection which is actually why I'm making this video <laughs> um, so basically uh, the new collection is called boss babe so to empower women, you know, and to tell you there's nothing you can't do, and it's, um, yeah, because we're all boss babes, right? We all just rule, so, uh, yeah, so this is a collection to kind of make us feel that way as well. And in this collection there was a lot of, like, um, basic colors, a lot of off-white, um, a lot of uh, brown, like, they had a new uh, color, I think it's called macchiato, like a darker brown, uh, some black, and also some patterns. Um, First off, I just want to say I really appreciate that when I go to the store, I get this bag <laughs> to carry home with me. So that's really nice. It's a nice tote bag. It's a nice bag, so you can take it for grocery shopping as well, and that's really nice. Um, so what I got from their uh, from their launch um, was uh, actually just three things, and I have another thing that they also launched in a different color than I had from before. So. Um, let's just talk about that at first. So they have this, I showed you the ripped seamless before, and they have this luxe seamless. So that's also seamless legging with their logo as always, but this time it's not like a, like not this ripped, but you have this, this pattern here, and it's nice and stretchy and some seams, some fake seams I should say, in the front and the back, and um, still like this nice curved glute seam back here to accentuate that butt and a nice tapered waist here some seams as well to kind of you know help tuck everything in and this came out in like an off-white color and also in this new macchiato and then they have like chops that go with that, brass that go with that uh, different types of brass even um, so yeah that's the Lux um, seamless. If you feel like, you know, I mean, with that word, that kind of suggests it's more luxurious. I do think it feels a little more luxurious, <laughs> to be honest. And I think this is, um, yeah, it's really nice. And I also like the new Makata colors, just I don't wear browns that much, I think. <laughs> At least not yet, so, uh, yeah, I didn't, I didn't get that. And the off-white I also know is not so for me. Um, maybe that's also, maybe I should say that as well, because my butt is quite big, right? So like I said, I squeeze, I mean, I shouldn't say I squeeze myself into small, the small fits. And it fits my waist perfectly, but then of course I stretch out the butt a little more than someone with a smaller butt would, which of course doesn't help with the squat proofness. So, maybe if you don't have a massive butt, you know, maybe the leggings will be more squat proof on you. So, I can only say how squat proof they are on me. And, um, that is not very... These are okay again, the, the dark colors are fine, but the white and everything light is just like, no, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> yeah, so these are the Luxe Seamless, and um, yeah, I mean, black is hard to see, but let's just try them on, okay? Alright, here we have the Luxe Seamless tights. So like I said, with black it's a bit hard to see, but they have some interesting uh, seam detailing in the front here. I don't know if you can see it. Um, no front seam, a nice waistband that keeps you tucked in, you know? And then like some nice uh, V-tapered waistband situation again for the butt. So yeah. And these again, 7 8 length I think. I, I think this is 7 8 length, okay? Like if it's not covering my ankle, I think this is kind of uh, what it is. <laughs> and um, yeah, these do come in different colors now. I also did back then, but you know. Uh, for me, black, I usually wear that when I just, you know, go shopping and I don't want to put on jeans or something. And, you know, I still want to look dressed, but I don't want to dress, so <laughs> this is why I have black leggings. Yeah, but I think these are super comfortable, the waistband is nice and stretchy, it keeps you tugged in. And for me, for example, with these, I don't have any gaping at the waist, so that's really nice. Yes, let's talk about the pattern that they had. So this was a dock tooth pattern, they have this in two colors, so it comes out in this, um, Macchiato, oh the tack, why you caught him here? Um, I didn't cut this off yet, <laughs> sorry. So, we have this nice um, strap bra. So this is the Macchiato Dock Tooth Strap Bra in a size small. So this, um, the Dock Tooth sets were made from recycled uh, materials. 
So that's also really nice. I always like when they do recycled materials. I'm just a bit skeptic because uh, the first time I tried something from recycled materials was an Onzi set, set last year and it just felt terrible. It was not stretchy, it was not soft, it was super scratchy, everything. And I was like, oh god, no, I don't really want that. And um, then recently Buff Bunny came out with some recycled materials and they felt so much nicer. And this also feels so much nicer. Super stretchy, super soft. It's still like a more mat performance material. And, but so like sleek and soft and everything. So I was like, yeah, okay, that's, yeah, I can do that. So this, the strap bra comes with the uh, adjustable straps. And then to go with that, we have the Macchiato Dog Tooth tights, which are these here. Um, yeah, it's more, like I said, it's more basic in terms of colors <laughs> than I usually wear, but that's, uh, that's also nice to have sometimes. Again, like a bit of a curved glute seam in the back here. Um, and yeah, like I said, they're stretchy. And what I also really liked is, usually with patterns, um, they're printed on like a white material, right? Or at least, so what I learned is that they always have to print um, a print on the lightest color that appears in the print. So if you have like a print with white and something else, it always has to be printed on white. And here, fortunately, it is a more darker color, right? You have black on brown, so the inside is actually also brown. So when you stretch it out, when you squat or something, it will not be like it will not appear sheer. Like with the white dog sheath pattern, for example, I could definitely see when I was like squatting in it or something, it you know, like the pattern kind of got lighter because of the white underneath. And it didn't really do that this much with this one because I mean it's brown underneath, so it doesn't really make too much of a difference when you stretch it out. So that was really, really nice to see. And like I said, they're so stretchy. So I didn't expect that from my recycled materials. Uh, because yeah, maybe my first recycled material um experience was not the best so but yeah these are really really nice and stretchy so yeah let's try this on all right here we have the macchiato dog tooth uh, set so the strap bra and the leggings or the tights um yeah let's just start with the bra so you have a nice scooped uh, front here um like i feel supported enough but of course if you just you know you have the single strap so if, um, I guess if you have a bit of larger boob, maybe you wouldn't feel too supported. I don't know. I think it's 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 nice though. And you have this nice white band. It's not elastic. It's just this band here. You have a seam right under your bust. Um, and yeah, it's just uh, so it's also kind of a long line bra. And then the back is just also nice and simple. Um, it doesn't scoop too low here. And then you have the adjustable straps, like uh, normal bra straps, basically. And yeah, then we have the tights. So these actually feel a little bit looser on the waist than the seamless tights do. Um, which, I, like, I don't mind, you know, it's uh, still not giving me too much, giving me a tiny bit, but it's not bad. And then you have their logo in the front, and this really feels so nice and soft and stretchy. Like, I wouldn't have guessed like this is that this is recycled material. Like, really, I wouldn't have. Um, it's just like, you know, it's really nice and soft and stretchy. And yeah, then the legs are like also like seven eighth on me again. And I mean, I guess you can, like if I squat a little, you can probably see the pattern stretching out a bit, but it's not really, like it, it doesn't turn whitish because like I said, it's, uh, it's brown underneath. So yeah, this is really, um, pretty nice and well made, I think. And it's also like, I mean, it's just a super like classic pattern, so you can just wear this with anything, right? And um, some nice and neutral colors as well. And like I said, this also comes in white and maybe a lighter brown, maybe it's the same brown, you know, it might just look lighter because it's paired with white. And yeah, the same set also in that color. But then, as I said, when you squat, it becomes a little more sheer, so. Yeah, but I think it is so stretchy. Also, I don't know if you can see it, but you have, again, the curved glute seam, so that's kind of like Eamon's thing as well. And then, you know, just to get that nice butt shape. And, yeah. Feels super great, soft, everything. Sleek performance material, you know. So, yeah, thumbs up for this. <laughs> uh, yeah. All right, what I also got is um, this beautiful and so soft white comfy cropped sweatshirt. So it's just a cropped sweatshirt. It is pretty pricey for a cropped sweatshirt, but it's absolutely worth it because it's so soft. Um, has like cuffed um, uh, arms, uh, sleeves, sleeves, right? <laughs> um, 
And then you have this Amen logo on here in the front. And it's just nice and cropped. Like, I feel like I'm like a, I don't know, I'm like a cool, you know, person when I wear these. I also have this one in black from uh, before. And it's just like, it's so so soft and you can just wear this over anything. And like I said, I feel cool when I wear these. So, um, and don't you want something that makes you feel cool, you know, um, sometimes? So yeah, these are it's just so nice and soft. And um, yeah, like I think white just goes with everything the same as black does. So this is why I'm happy now to have them in, uh, to have this in white and in black. And you know, the they also have this as a full length sweater. And why? Like I think it would be so nice and cozy to have this as a full length sweater. I know I don't really like to wear full length sweaters that much. Sure, I wouldn't mind it if it was a little longer. You know, slightly less crop basically, but I don't like I don't like to wear full length too much. I don't think it's flattering on me on my body type. But yeah, if you like full length sweaters, I'm like this would be amazing because it's just so soft. I wish I could tell you how like or show you how soft this is, but I mean like you can't feel it through the camera unfortunately. It is also made with 53% modal, 41% polyester and 6% elastane. Um yeah, it's just the, the the softest and like oh god, most coziest thing ever and just you know, just throw it over anything and you look well dressed, I think. <laughs> so yeah. Um Let's just throw this on. <laughs> All right, I just threw this comfy cropped uh, sweatshirt over the dog tooth set. And I mean, so I think the white fits, but I think the black probably fits better with this. But like I said, I also have the black, so. Yeah, but I mean, it's just like, I feel so cool wearing this. I don't know, <laughs> like, like I said, it's just makes me feel like, you know, look at me, I'm just cool. <laughs> I, g I guess it's not really cool. I don't know, but whatever. <laughs> Let me know what you think. Um, yeah, it's like the sleeves are definitely long enough, you know. It's nice and oversized and like wide, and you can just move in it and just be cozy in it. And yeah, here the logo on the chest. I don't know if you can see it. Come a little closer. There. And um, it, I mean, it is a very short length, so you'll definitely see the sports bra underneath. Um, so yeah, I wouldn't wear this with a normal bra. <laughs> But like with a nice sports bra or something, it's just, you know, perfect, like, um, crop. And it's just, it's so cozy. So yeah, the name definitely does not lie. And it's also a perfect fit with the, um, the, the jogger sweatpants and that I have with the drawstring. Because the, the fabric is very similar, I think. And just fits very, I think it would just go very well together. So yeah, definitely a great piece. It's a little longer in the back, I think, yes. But then also, if you lift your arms here, you know, you'll still see the sports bra. But yeah, makes me feel cool. So if you want to feel cool too, you know, maybe you already feel cool, but yeah, if you want to feel cool and you don't, yeah, but just, yeah, whatever. Let's just not talk any further about this. <laughs> Great jumper. I just like it. So, yeah. All right. Um, then uh, I will quickly talk about, like, uh, two pieces that they also had that I think were super popular that didn't get uh, but I tried them on when I was in the store so there was the cargo pants that sold out immediately on their website basically um, they were not very cheap um, I think they were around a thousand hundred kroner which is around 110 euros maybe or 120 dollars maybe something like that and um, they were made like it's like they were like kind of you know outdoor pants like you could go hiking them so I was like oh maybe this is something nice because I do like to go hiking a lot um and they also had this elastic belt with like um the clasp the plastic clasp and so they're of course less stretchy than legs so I was like okay you know what I'm just gonna try on the medium and with the medium it was so big in the waist even with the clasp belt because of course the belt in the medium would also be you know a bit looser than the small belt and then still the thighs and butt area was a bit like I mean, yes, it fits, but it's, I, I want to feel like I can, you know, do s the splits and something. I mean, I can't do the splits, but I want to feel like I could do it if I wanted to. And that was just not, um, yeah, that was just not the feeling I got from these. Because they, they lacked the stretch, basically, for me. And I know a lot of people love them so much. And I think if you have the right body type for it, like if you don't have massive butt and like bigger thighs, you'll probably it'll probably be super nice and comfortable. But for me, it was just like uh, no, I'm just, no. Like if I pay so much money for something, I really want it to fit perfectly, and I want to feel 100% comfortable in it. 
Um, and I mean, it looks great on people, you know, uh, and I, I mean, I also think it looked great on me, but it just didn't feel right, right? So I didn't get those. And then they also had the, the shiny tights with the belt. So you actually had like the belt loops and everything, and then this belt that came with it, and they were nice and shiny. And while I liked them, like, when am I gonna wear leggings, shiny leggings with a belt? Yeah, exactly. I was like, no. I have so many shiny leggings because I love shiny leggings, you know, and this was also more this like, not like glittery, shimmery, but it was just like really shiny. I don't know if I have something to compare it to, but like, it just was like overall shiny material. It also felt like more of a synthetic shiny material, like something you don't really want to sweat in too much. And it looks so cool with the belt, but it, it also made the waist, of course, be like, whoop, snatched in. But like I said, I wouldn't ever go to wear this, right? So I was like, you know, I'm sensible today and I'm just not gonna get it. So yeah, I know it doesn't happen very often, but I can't be sensible. <laughs> So, but yeah, if you, if you feel like this is exactly your, like, I feel like if you get the black ones with the belt and something and you just, you know, maybe next year when we can all party again, that would probably be a really great fit. It's just like some, maybe the black short, like, cropped sweater, right? And you can just party. Um, or just be comfortable. But yeah, for me, it wasn't like, nah, probably not. Um, but yeah, that was the, the boss babe stuff that they had. And... Yeah, I will insert some pictures, of course, so you can you can see what they look like. Okay, uh, one thing I forgot to talk about. All right, I also want to talk quickly about like one of their all-time, I think one of the customers' like favorites that is still on the website as well are these ocean. I don't know if they're ocean rib seams tight or ocean tights. You know, I will insert it here, and um, these have these like jeans look. Which is why I was intrigued at first. And they have like so many different like design, like so many different things going on. So you have this this waistband that has the Amen logo here like written on it, and then a rip, this rib waistband then basically with also like some nice glute seams here, or some nice glute seams. This nice seam that goes deeper and you know and accentuates the glutes, and um, no front seam either. And then you have on the thigh this like these seams here and then on the leg itself it's not it's it's different again you know and yeah these are super or were super popular at least because of all the um like this jeans look and i also have this suitable uh, long sleeve i just think i threw it in the beginning there and um yeah let's also try these on shall we all right now i have the ocean seamless attention tights for you with the you know the long sleeve that goes with it so here I can show you why I usually like to wear the smalls instead of the medium. So this is a medium because the thighs <laughs> fit better in the medium. And then you can see how loose the waistband is on me. Like if I squat, there's so much gaping and I don't really like that so much. And I mean, they still st stay st uh, still stay up because they're nice and snug on my thighs here. But yeah, the waistband is a little uh, loose on these. And like I said, I prefer my waistbands to fit me. And um, yeah, this one is a little more you know, just hanging out there. Um, yeah, otherwise I think it's a really nice uh, color because it's like super, like it just looks like jeans, you know? And then, like I said, you have all the details across your thigh here. Again, more of a 7 8 uh, leggings for me. And yeah, I mean, I like these, you know, except for this uh, the light, um, wider waist. Uh, yeah. Again, also, you have that rip, um, waistband and you know the the butt accentuation here and no front seam all right so with Amen they do release some new collections every now and then sometimes they bring out super new pieces sometimes they just bring out um, customers favorites in different colors so uh, like I said, they do have a lot of basic colors always in stock, like some nice grays, some beige tones, some like black, of course, always. So um, if you really like the seamless stuff, for example, they will definitely always have something, uh, something there uh, on their website. And like, yeah, sometimes they become, bring out new patterns in a different collection, they bring out new colors in a different collection. Um, this teal seamless set, for example, was from last year's Mermaid collection. So of course it was like a teal because it's Mermaid and then the yellow and the bright orange were like from a summer, more summery uh, collection. So yes, it's always like new colors, maybe old styles. So if you have something that you really like, you can 
you know, they might bring in new colors and you can just grow your collection of these things. Um, like I do with the long sleeves, for example, because I think it's just so great to wear them with any type of legging and that's why I need all the colors, right? So I can wear it and just change uh, the look. Um, the Lux Seamless is a new staple, definitely. Um, yes, and some of their um, some of their loungewear is also always there. Like in summer, they always have also like some swimwear, and yeah, all in all, they have like a lot of variety of stuff. There's always something on their website you can buy, not just like with some uh, of the lounge based uh, companies. And um, yeah, if you're European, this is great for you without having to pay the uh, high in import fees and you can return stuff easily and their customer service is also great and um, sh things ship very fast and um, yes I think uh, all in all this is a really a nice website to buy from like I said for me also the advantage is I have a store in town that I can go to um, to see the, the pieces in like in flesh and blood basically and just try it on there um, and that's just uh, really nice yeah. Anyway, I really hope uh, you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, leave them in the in the comment box below. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I always forget saying that. <laughs> if you like uh, my videos and you know if you want to support me, and yeah, feel free to DM me on Instagram to uh, yeah leave a comment here. If you have any questions, any suggestions, um, any feedback, like telling me you know just be faster, more concise, whatever. Because um, I should really be better at that. <laughs> uh, my goal was to make this video shorter than my first video, and you know, I, I don't think I really succeeded. So, yes. Um, I really hope you liked uh, today's video though. And yeah, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and see you next time. Bye!